Hi everyone, I'm David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors and we're going to be learning how to add a background image using Dreamweaver. You're going to be adding a background image, maybe sometimes your logo or an image that um, illustrates your product, things like that. So it'll be better, very beneficial to do that and uh, you'll see how easy it is in just a few steps. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your properties panel is open. If it is not open, you want to come up to window and choose properties. And for some of you, it might come up on top and then some of you might come down at the bottom. So you can see mine's down here at the bottom. And what we want to look at is our page properties. So come down to the bottom and you're going to see page properties. And you're going to see we have a bunch of different things here. We're going to be focused on the appearance tab here under category. So you see we have a few different things like page font and size, text color, background color, and we also have our background image. And that's what we're going to focus on for here. So we're just going to click on browse and it's going to basically take me hopefully to our source where our site root is. So you should know what that is when you created your site and mine is just called Story Street. And then you'll see here I have a few different files <clears throat> and you notice that some of them are grayed out and some of them are a little more lit up. The ones that are lit up, you guess it, are image files like GIFs and JPEGs and um, maybe PNGs and things like that. Okay, so it knows to look for image files. So this is the one I'm focused on, the Story Street. So, no, excuse me, it's going to be Bamboo. Okay, and then you see that uh, Mac gives me a little preview of it. And if you're on um, PC, you should also have um, a thumbnail view of it as well. So, now that I've chosen it, I'm just going to go ahead and click Choose. And now, it takes me to the window and I see here, Bamboo Single Cane dot GIF. And that is the path that leads to my image. Now, before I click OK, I want to show you this part right down here, this Repeat. Okay, now by default, Dreamweaver will repeat your image over and over and over again, given as much space as, as you allow it. So I don't want it to repeat, so I'm going to click on this drop down and I'm going to choose no repeat. Okay, and down here at the margins, you can decide where you want it within the page, um, how many pixels from the left, right, bottom, and top as well. So I'm just going to keep it as is. And then I'm just going to go ahead and click OK. And then just like that, my image appears before me. Thanks. Well, that concludes our tutorial on how to add a background using Dreamweaver. And once again, I'm uh, David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors. You can find more about my company going to Yelp.com and typing in San Francisco Computer Tutors. And uh, look me up anytime. Thanks.